hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is meekness and here on this channel i do everything here recently we started a series on amazing things you can do with straight hair which i have the playlist on my channel we've done a lot of amazing things with straight hairs and today we are going to be doing low cut wig using straight hair some people call it straw coil wig just look at how amazing it looks all right guys thank you so much for coming back to my channel if you're an old subscriber thank you so much for coming back and if you're a new subscriber thank you so much for clicking on this video please do not click off without clicking on that red subscribe button with that being said let's jump right into the video i'm going to be using this straight hair this was from the last tutorial i did on my channel this half remaining and I will be needing straw and Vaseline. So here you see I already made a lot of this piece. So you need a Vaseline. You don't need to fish your attach, but if you want to, you can. But fishing it will make you have a lot of, what should I call it? But you have a lot to trim at the end of it. So this, you don't have to twist your attachment. You just have to wrap it like you're wrapping full locks. That's just basically what you do. And then you wrap all the way down. So when you get to the bottom of it, you spread it and wrap upward. That's to lock it so it doesn't unravel itself. So this is what it will look like. And I'm just going to trim it a little. But if you fish this attachment, you're going to have a lot to trim. All right, I already made a lot of this. I made some really, really short, some really, really fat, some slim, some long. And that's because I'm not perfect. So you see, some are so short, some were so fat, some were so long because I'm not perfect. So if you want it to be equal, you have to be very careful, very, very careful. So when you are done, you just put it inside hot water and let it dry. And then you are ready to start making your wig. The wig cap I'm going to be using is this double wig cap. It's really light and stretchy. So you can get a stronger one. But this one I prefer because it gives you this holding look when you actually wear this cap. And then you're going to be needing a pin, any kind of pin. I like using this one because it doesn't interrupt any sewing. The head is so flat on. It doesn't interrupt your sewing. But you can use any pin to hold down this cap because it's really stretchy. Even with this holding self, I still had a lot of issues with it. So now I'm going to be using this to start. So you put this needle right on the hole created by the straw. A lot of people do this wig with um, multi attachments or multi extension. That's what a lot of people do this week with. But if you can get multi extension, you can as well make yours like this. Or you can buy a multi extension um, expression. Multi extension expression. Abby. 
okay yeah that's what it's called multi extension you can buy it and use it for this wig because that's what i see a lot of people use i just decided to create mine because we do amazing things with straight hair here so this is how you go round round guys let me fast forward this process You will have to place this core is really close and so it's closely together so you don't end up having space in between. If you look closely, you see that the band of the two wig cap are not together. Maybe that's because I did not pin the two well or I don't know what happened. But just be careful so your own doesn't come out that way. Okay.
I used about a quarter of one full expression to get this. So I'm going to be cutting out this front. Some people usually, after cutting out this um, front, they brush the hair. But I love this coils. I don't think I'll brush it anytime soon. Maybe when I finish rocking the coils, I'm going to brush it out. So that it looks really, really low cut. But now I'm going to rock it as straw coils. What do you think, guys? Please let me know in the comment section below. And thank you guys so much for staying tuned to this point. I promise you guys more amazing content. See you guys next week, Wednesday. Bye.